The probation unit within the Citizens Welfare Division of the Ministry of Social Transformation educated citizens on its mission and functions as a call was made for parental support for the beneficiaries of the program. Recently, the unit held a sensitization meeting for parents and other individuals at the Multipurpose Cultural Center. Probation officer Alicia Byers gives the rationale behind the meeting. This meeting is intended to serve as the beginning of an important dialogue between all partners, including you, families, the youth themselves, victims, and other service providers. Its purpose is to ensure that all parents are knowledgeable about probation. Perhaps more than any other at this school, the youth in the juvenile justice system need meaningful relationships and supportive guidance from the adults in their lives. Everyone has a personal stake in healthy development of each child and can play a role. The importance of the family involvement before, during, and after the juvenile justice experience is acknowledged within the system. Juvenile rehabilitation and counseling of adults are among the duties of the unit. Some 100 offenders have been supervised 80% being juveniles and 20% adults. Baez says the unit has been going with persons ready to make a difference in the lives of individuals. We are prone to report that we have 11 probation officers, all of whom have received tertiary education in addition to having learned skills and knowledge to provide guidance to those who are placed in our care. The mandate of the probation service is rehabilitation in respect of reducing crime and the most critical component is non-custodial care. Their interactive session saw members of the unit in attendance to illustrate through presentations the usefulness of an initiative that has been changing the lives of youth in Antigua and Barbuda.